Scientists are calling this phenomenon snow blood. Patches of red snow that can be seen gleaming in the sunlight in the French Alps. Locals say it's becoming more and more prominent in early summer. The crimson colour is caused by the presence of an algae. The phenomenon is accelerating snowmelt, and scientists say it could be due to climate change. Eric Marichal and his team from Grenoble's Scientific Research National Centre are collecting samples of the algae on Le Brevant Mountain. He says the microalgae typically has a green colour, but turns red when exposed to strong solar radiation. When it's in the snow, it accumulates a pigment, like sunscreen, to protect itself from the light intensity. Like us, when we go skiing, or even here, today, we are getting sunburnt and we use sunscreen. The algae, to protect themselves, well we think it's for this, because we don't have the proof yet, accumulate this red pigment that overcomes the green. So they are fundamentally green, but it's hidden behind a big shield of red pigments. A gros bouclier de pigment rouge. The algae was first described by Aristotle in the 3rd century BC, but it was only formally identified and given its Latin name Sanguina nivoloids in 2019. Scientists are now racing to understand it better before it's too late, as rising global temperatures are hitting the Alps disproportionately hard. There are two reasons for studying the algae. The first is that it is an area that is little explored. And the second reason is that this little explored area is melting before our eyes. So it's kind of urgent. We have to quickly deploy means to collect samples. This is what we are doing today. And then study them with all the modern means that exist in biology. Some scientists say the volumes of algae appear to be growing due to climate change with higher carbon dioxide concentrations in the atmosphere favouring blooms. Alberto Amato is a genetic engineering researcher at CEA Centre de Grenoble. What we also know is that with time, when the level of CO2 increases in the atmosphere, we find red snow more often. So it's likely linked to global warming, and the warmer it is, the more algae there are, and the more the snow melts quickly. So it's a bit of a vicious cycle, and we're trying to understand all the mechanisms and this cycle, so we can try and do something about it. We try to understand exactly all the mechanisms that produce this cycle to eventually do something. Research is ongoing. But what is certain is that the presence of the algae accelerates snow melt. That's because the algae's pigment reduces its ability to reflect the sun's heat. If the algae do spread, snow and glacier melt around the world could speed up.